With regard to Syria, the safety of the, of the diplomatic missions, we have seen uh, prior uh, the U.S. ambassador has uh, been subjected to harassment that caused the U.S. government to call him. Over the weekend, the attacks on the embassies of Saudi Arabia, Qatar, and Jordan. Uh, in the light of this continued pattern, what are the measures that exist to protect the diplomatic missions that they are currently serving in Syria? Because the attacks have been quite selective based on the country's political positions, whether in the Arab League or in general with the uh, supporting of the oppositions in Syria. Well, it's up, it's up to the Syrian government to, under international law to provide protection to diplomatic premises and it's also up to the individual diplomatic, uh, or diplomatic uh, premises to have their own security in, in place. We're not going to tell them how to do that. That's something that's up to them.